Hello and welcome back to Azure Terraformer. Last time we looked at how to create Entra ID users and create role assignments to grant them access to our Azure subscription. This time I'm going to create an Entra ID group and grant a group access to my Azure subscription. Now this is probably the more preferable approach uh, because managing role-based access control on an individual user basis is not a best practice. It can become very tedious very quickly as the number of users scale up. So bear that in mind. Without further ado, let's drop into the code. So if you recall from last episode, I created an Entra ID user for Thomas Callahan III. I think this time I'm just going to go and create an Azure AD group. And you'll notice there is a lot of information in the documentation about what directory permissions your identity needs to have access in order to work with groups. So I'm just gonna use this very basic example and we're gonna get rid of Thomas Callahan III and we're just gonna call this the sales team. And we're using a, an Azure AD client config, which it's important to call out that this is different than the Azure RM client config. Different data source in a different provider, but they essentially do the same thing. And often you can use them interchangeably. Um, but to, to keep things uh, clean here, um, I'm going to actually create an Azure AD client config um, and reference it the way that they do. So um, Azure AD client config, because I'm using the same credentials to authenticate to Azure AD or Entra ID and Azure, um, this, uh, this is object ID is gonna come back as the same user. It's whoever Terraform is logged in as, which is me because I've logged in interactively using AZ login. If this was done in a pipeline, this would be taking whatever identity the pipeline was running under, whether it be a managed identity or a service principle. More on service principles in an upcoming episode. Anyways, so I think this is pretty good. Security enabled. Um, let me go look at my role assignment. And this is no longer for Thomas Callahan. This is for our sales team. And I need to update this code to reference an Azure AD group, Entra ID group, and we should be good to go. And let me run Terraform apply and see if we can just get this going right off the bat. And just like with Thomas Callahan III, we are provisioning, actually we don't need to provision a random string anymore because groups don't have passwords. Um, so I could probably clean that up. Let me just answer no. Of course I could type anything in there um, I don't need this thing anymore. Uh, let me see if I need all these other things. I do need the subscription, but I don't need the Azure RM client config. So I think we're good there. And there we go. We got the role assignment for sales for our target subscription, and we're creating a new group. Now Terraform will handle the dependency cross provider very elegantly um, in this situation because Azure and Entra ID work so well together. and I think because both of these resource types are essentially logical. There's no physical metal that needs to be provisioned. So there's less a chance for some, some sort of startup time or initialization state to impact downstream dependencies. So I'm just gonna hit yes, and we're gonna provision that group. A few moments later. And there we go. We have our group and we have our role assignment. Let's go to the Microsoft 365 admin portal and go check out our groups. And there's my sales team group that was created today. And let's go to the role assignments and see what we got here. And there we go, I got my group sales team. Now I just need to add users uh, or other identities to this group and they will get whatever permissions, in this case reader, access to my subscription. That's it. I hope this helps and if you're enjoying this channel and you wanna see more of the Entra ID or the Azure AD provider, uh, please smash that like button and consider subscribing. It really helps out a lot. And also, if you want to declare yourself to the world as an official Azure Terraformer, consider channel membership. It's a great way to help out the channel. Anyways, that's it from me. This is the Azure Terraformer, signing off.